Okay, I'm a big man, and I need a big cup. <laughs> Good morning, friends. My name is Brandon Dayton. I am your humble narrator. Welcome back to Project Zomboid. I got bit in the last episode, and uh, I'm not feeling too hot at the moment. So I'm a little bit nauseous, gonna try and take things a little bit easy this episode, not do too much running around and shit like that. Uh, I'm trying to keep this bandage nice and changed and disinfected so I can hopefully survive this scratch and not become one of the undead. It looks like it's healing relatively well, but uh, the nauseous and, and nervous are making me nauseous and nervous. <laughs> it's really not going to be good if I spent so long building a base and all that shit only to get uh, yammed up by some lady zombie. Just wandering around. Hmm. Oh. Vitamins provide a burst of energy when taken. Reduces fatigue. Wow. Is that true? Should I be taking more vitamins IRL? Probably. Your body needs that. Well, it's not raining anymore, so... I guess I'm gonna go uh, out again on my own. Here I go again on my own Going down the only road I've ever known Like a drifter I was born to walk alone And I've made up my mind I ain't wasting no more time I could leave this book on the floor. I already read that one. Oh, this is my uh, garlic peanut butter tuna ham sandwich or some crap like that. Some disgusting creation that I made, and it's totally going to make me feel better. See? See? Look how much better I feel now. <sighs> oh, God. Things are looking really bad for the Dayton does. Hmm. Well, not much that can be done, I fear. I can fix up this baseball bat just a little bit. Da 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 da. Aw oh, yeah. That's looking good. Boom. Boom. It's almost back to 100%. Do it. Do it. There's like diminishing returns or some shit like that. That's about as close as we're gonna get. So, uh, throw those wood glues back in the bag. And, uh, I should probably find something, some entertainment, or some such. Hmm. This house seems overgrown. Have I not been here before? Everything looks pretty dead. Hmm, canned beans! I got a can of beans. Gonna eat my can of beans, yeah. Gotta keep my strength up. So I can fight the infection that's growing in my body. I hope it's not growing inside my body. It's not a very good song. Inside my body. <sighs> oh god. Fuck. Almost got me again, didn't ya? Didn't ya? Didn't ya? Mm! Husband and wife. And they shall be together forever. In death. Oh man. Freaking me out. Freaking me out just a little bit. Everything's okay. Alright. Disassemble radio. Ooh. Let's let's turn on the radio. Hello? Anybody here? Knox talk radio. Hmm. There's no signal. Kentucky Radio. There's no signal for any of this. All the radio stations are dead. Wow, you can drag headphones or earbuds in here and click to remove them. That's fucking amazing. This is some next level shit going on in Project Zomboid, I'll tell you what. Oh, man. Not much for me in here, I do fear. I'm gonna eat this whole watermelon. That'll fill me up. That'll make me feel better. 
And then I'll go ahead and uh, check the bookshelf. See if I can find something that will... Yeah! Boredom and stress! Get rid! I need to read this. Hello, I am a book. I am a very good book. Hey, that was a good book. Now I'm just a little anxious and a little queasy. I guess I should take some more antidepressants and beta blockers and vitamins. Keep myself nice, nice and healthy. Keep myself so healthy. Nice and healthy, y'all. Copper working. I haven't read. I will do so. Expert electrical. I don't even know how to level electrical shit. I'm an electrician with absolutely no electrical uh, knowledge. It's for beginners. Okay. I'm past the beginner point now. I think I'm at intermediate electricals. Electricals. Trapping for intermediates. Nope. Nope. It ain't gonna happen. Ain't gonna happen. Should we forage? Can I forage something? I guess I gotta go back out into the boonies. This is too near the city to forage. Hmm. Sprinting is looking pretty good. Oh, I need to not run. It says that I'm queasy, so I need to take it easy. Easy squeezy. Now we're back to the school. Hmm. My legs keep leading me back to the school. Should I think that there is something important in here? Oh my god. I left the door open last time. It's just like in every horror movie ever made. Always leave the door open. Don't forget that you should leave the door open. I know there's a killer chasing you, but don't close that door. That would be rude. Just so rude. Hmm, I think everything's rotten in here by now. Oh no, they got preserved stuff. Preserved junk. Mmm, fresh orange. I eat. Gotta keep that strength up. Mm-hmm. If I stay well fed, I think I can fight this infection more effectively. Oh, I'm gonna take this pineapple. Nice pineapple. I'm taking this. I'm taking this. Mm. I'm gonna eat this whole pineapple so much to the point that it hurts my mouth. Have you ever had that happen? Or you eat like a shit ton of pineapple and then you're just like, wow. My mouth is in excruciating pain and feels like it's bleeding everywhere. But this pineapple is so delicious that I need a little bit more. A little bit more of this pineapple. Maybe that house on the corner isn't burning down because I left a, a sandwich in the, in the oven. Which isn't how things would work at all. It burns down more when you leave a sandwich in the oven, which was my, uh, my thinking when I placed it there. Prosthetic leg and a wedding ring. Wow. Some dude was nice to marry the lady with the prosthetic leg. Or maybe he's into, like, stump worship, you know? <laughs> you, you, you guys know about that? There's people who are, like, into people that have, uh, missing limbs and shit like that. I read the story about a guy who was born with, like, no arms and no legs, and he got married, too. That lady's probably into stump worship. It's really weird. He's just a torso, but he has a kid. Damn. Damn. This world be weird, yo. Or maybe that lady's just really nice. I shouldn't say that she definitely has a weird sexual fetish, just because of who her partner is. Wow, I'm braining all these dudes. There's another! That's the guy with the prosthetic leg in the wedding ring. I bet he's married to the lady with the prosthetic leg in the wedding ring. They have to know each other because they both have prosthetic legs. Isn't that how the world works? I'm not sure. I've never been out in the world before. I'm braining the shit out of everything. I'm a little bit anxious. But I guess that uh, gives me the adrenaline. So I can just smash these zombies. One shot, one shot, one shot. Damn. It's all of a sudden things are turning around. I went from like, I'm definitely gonna die to like, I'm fucking Superman. <laughs> oh, it might have something to do with repairing the bat as well. Don't quote me on that. I ain't too sure. Ain't none too sure. 
about nothing anymore. Hmm, it's so early in the morning. Early in the morning. I'm sure there's some trouble we can get into. That's my old base over there on the corner. I'm relatively sure. Maybe we should have a little stop by. It's been a while since I've been in there, right? Yeah. Hello, base. Hello, home. So nice to see you again. Ooh. We could have fun with this. That'll be a nice thing, although I have to take it pretty far away from the base in order to, uh, to do. Alright, we're not too overloaded, I guess. Let's equip. Or oh, we're gonna be really overloaded without the doctor bag. Extremely heavy load! And I don't really want to leave my doctor bag anywhere. Can I put the doctor bag in the other bag? Ooh, bagception! What? Alright, now reload. Yeah, press R to reload. One, two, three, four, five. Now let's see if I'm any good with this rifle. I was gonna shoot that lady, but that's really not a good idea. Not so close to the hoose. I think my aiming is really low anyways. Yeah, aiming level three. I really should be using a shotgun. Uh, you can't really hit much with a rifle at this aiming level, but we're gonna try. We're gonna give it a shot. Can I forage out here? Anything? Anything at all? Hmm. Gotta go into the trees. I hear some birds. Maybe I can make a bird trap. Eat some delicious sparrow breast. Ooh. I'd prefer, like, quail or chicken or turkey. But we take what we can get around here. Hmm. I got my baseball bat, right? Yeah, okay. Just in case I need to fall back on that, we can do that. Hey, lady! Oh, that's loud. Oh, that's so loud. Well, I got her. It took me a few rounds, but I got her. Don't you worry. I'm gonna drag all the zombies this way. Come along, follow the Pied Piper! It's a fun thing to do in the mornings. Just go, uh, go for a little shoot. A little zombie hunt. Click, click. God oh, damn it. Ah, I really should be using a shotgun. Hey, there's one. And two. Alright. We're doing pretty good. Now I know why I left this in the, in that house. Am I, am I getting my aiming up? 103.5. 103.5, the wave! Hello all you cool dudes and dudettes out there. You're listening to 103.5, the wave! Oops. I think that was five. Might have been four. Hey, but we got him. We got him, no problem. And do you have to kill something or just fire? I think you have to kill something. Kill something and it gives you 3.5 experience. Or 2.5. My math is pretty shit. I need to keep a better count on my ammo. That is for sure, at least. Yeah. Make sure there's nobody over here. Reload a little bit. Is it two experience per zombie? Are the lady zombies worth less? I don't understand. Well, my queasiness and all that's gone away. I don't have uh, any adrenaline or whatnot either. Hey, nice. Good shot. Might have to keep this rifle for a little bit later. 762. 
I think I have some more rounds like this back at the hoose. But I'm running low on ammos now. So, uh... Hmm. So it was, uh, at least halfway fruitful, kind of, maybe. Now I'll go in here and check, but... You, you don't go in the house with a loaded gun. Everybody knows that. Okay. Doctor's bag secondary. Wonderful. We're just doing so many nice things here today. And can I shove this gun somewhere? Oh my god, the fucking dogs! They're back again! Ten points every time you hear a dog bark. You get a lot of points listening to Dayton does. At least right now. We're gonna move to a new house eventually, and then I'll be like, Hey! No more dogs barking! No more points for anybody! But until that point, just uh, try to enjoy all the points. All the free points that you get. This is the game where the points don't matter. Just like, whose line is it anyways? Whose line is it anyways? I don't know. I don't know. I'm just Drew Carey. <laughs> oh, Drew Carey. How some people miss you. Not me. Not me. No, no, no. Just, just, just saying. Some people do. <laughs> uh, peanut butter, sugar, whiskey. Mmm. I'm gonna drink this whiskey. That's what I need. Mmm. That'll fight my infection. Is this infection still a thing, or uh, did we live? We lived! Ho 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 ho! Thank fuck. My first wound from a zombie. Just uh, a friendly reminder from the game to be more careful. Hey, hey, hey! More careful! You need to be extra careful around here. Well, I wasn't aware. But I, I will be in the future. Thank you so much. Mmm. Grape juice. That's nice. I'm gonna fill up these empty bottles. Cause while the water's on... Oh fuck. More gunshots, of course. Well, I did my fair sh my fair share of shooting out here, so, um... I guess I can't blame them. Sometimes you just get, need to get drunk, drink some whiskey, shoot some zombies, I don't know. What do you want from me? You think I'm some kind of zombie scientist? Well, I am. I'm the best zombie scientist anybody knows of. Because I'm the only one in my field. Understand? Understand that? Now that whiskey bottle is filled up with water. And that's really what you should do when you drink a whiskey. That's super important. Okay, guys? Just always drink uh, one cup of water for every cup of alcohol that you drink. And that, me that means shots, too. Don't drink a glass of whiskey and have one glass of water. There's like... I think there's eight shots if you put it in a, in a regular-ass cup. Just one of those little cups. Those cups that nobody drinks from. Cups... <laughs> cups should be giant. Okay, I'm a big man, and I need a big cup. So I try to use them, them double-sized cups. But it doesn't always work that way. Sometimes people are like, I got a little glass. It's like, alright. We'll make do then. Hmm. I need to drop some things off, that's for sure. I got a lot of nails, a lot of watermelon slices, a lot of luck, because I, I healed. I healed. I lived through a zombie scratch and I healed. I am the best, so you should yield. Not a very good song, but it doesn't matter. Uh-oh. Feeling a little drowsy. Drowsy. That's a Pokemon. Yeah, it's a Pokemon, you guys. Alright. Um, can I find an empty shelf here somewhere? Please, thank you. That's a garbage bag. That's a shelf. Now all my shit's ruined again. <gasps> Come on. Why are you doing this, huh? Here. 
Pack it up, pack it in, let me begin. Battle me, that's a sin. Cause I'm a Terminator, like Arnold Schwarzenegger. Something, something, get up and get down. Hashtag House of Pain. That's actually a, a rap group. I was gonna say a good rap group, but I don't think I know any songs besides that one. So, <laughs> that's the end of the statement. It's all over now. Don't ask me any more questions about them. Because uh, that's about all I can tell you. Say, hey, Dayton, tell me about uh, House of Pain, and I'll say, the guys that did Jump Around, right? That's a pretty good song. And the only song that I know that they did. Hmm. I guess I'm going to leave this Mosin, Mosin Nagant stripper clip. That doesn't sound good. Why do we have a stripper clip in there? I want a, a decent clip. A clip that still loves its parents. Ha 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 ha. Oh, I'm funny. I'm just so freaking funny. I'm gonna keep this needle, too. It took me so long to find the needle that I'm never gonna let it go. Ever in life. It's staying in my bag. I know it's not easy to find all the time. But I needs it. That's a lot of box of nails. There's a shit ton of nails in this place now. Got my smoke bomb, got my chewing gum, my watermelon slices. We're looking pretty good. We're looking pretty good, kids. Um, maybe I should put some of this away. Here, let's, uh, let's box this. Box of nails can go here. And that's at least a pound that we were able to get rid of. Kitchen knife, fishing rod can go away. Little bait fish, I don't think I need either. Beta blockers, antidepressants, disinfectant, adhesive bandages. Oops. Put it inside the bag. Thank you so much. Let's see, can opener. How we looking? How we looking? Not too bad. Not too bad, I think it's gonna do. Let's see if I can uh, go to sleep in this bed, or if I need to bust down some outdoor shelves. I think I need to bust down some outdoor shelves. Yep. Yep, a Rooney. Yep, a Rooney Dooney. Disassemble hardwood wall shelves. Requires a hammer. Don't I have a hammer? What the fuck happened to my hammer? There it is. Keep in main inventory. Thank you so much. Oh, and I need a saw. Well, well, I've got the saw as well, game. Thank you so much. You've been so helpful. Boom! This bullshit. And now I'm drenched. Oh my god. This is not going well. I've got a bath towel somewhere, I think. Where's my fucking bath towel? He failed to produce any usable materials. So I just destroyed my shelf for no reason at all. Wonderful. Exactly how I like it. Um, bath towel. Dry self. Yay! Oh, that works so good! And now I'm just wet. And now my bath towel's wet. So do I have to, like, drop it? Use another bath towel? Fart, man. I don't understand anything! Hmm. Hmm. Expert carpentry? I've read it. The carpentry I need now? Oh, that is expert. And then we're gonna be master. A master carpenter. Metalworking? What the fuck is metalworking? Aw, oh, man. Alright, have a nap. Have a little nappy nap. Our sleep schedule is gonna get all fucked up. I'm so sure of it. But it be what it be. Alright, wake up. Now wake up. I should have set the fucking alarm. Ah! Yeah, we'll wake up at midnight. That's, that's a great thing. So, friends, I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. Thank you so much for watching. This has been Project Zomboid Day 74? 75? Something like that? 
Uh, we're doing pretty good. We survived a scratch, so so I'm I'm extremely grateful for that. If you do remember to like, comment, and or subscribe on this episode, and I hope that you will because I did end up living through that scratch, then I will send you a box of toothpicks, and uh, you can drop them on the floor and count them in, the, in an instant if you're Rain Man or some shit like that. Anyways, thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. And until then, friends, bye bye One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends. <laughs>